Yo, what's going on you guys? Today I'm going to be showing you what I've completed within 100 hours of Military Tycoon. As some of you may know, I've been banned on YouTube for about 7 days. This is my 5th day at the moment, so in 2 days I'll be able to upload this, and by then I'll most likely have a billion cash and 4,000 gems. That's what I'm shooting for by Sunday. So make sure you leave a like on this video and subscribe, and let's get into this. So as of today, I've got 628,236,111 cash and 3,015 gems. By Sunday, I'm expecting to reach a much higher level than that. I've also got my soldiers upgraded to the max. They're all level 10 with their golden guns, as you can see. It looks beautiful. I was so excited to get the max level. This was so fun, honestly. Yo, don't even get me started with the amount of times I've had to come all the way down here and grab the scuba gear to go and get the balloons guys yo i've had to do it so many times i've at least had to do it at least 80 times bro and then if there happened to be more people in the server and they were fighting over the crate i literally had to go over here and get my soldiers over and over again every single time i die so basically this is how it works right so hold on let me explain for some people that might be new to military tycoon real quick so basically let's say a crate landed right here in the water right i gotta go down to my bunker grab my scuba gear i gotta grab my soldiers in case someone comes and tries to kill me with their soldiers and then once you're done grabbing your crate you pretty much have to reset and kill yourself, go back to your base, grab all your stuff again, and then go back out to the next crate. That's how I was doing it, because I was going by jet, since it's obviously the fastest way to get to one of these crates, especially when it's across the map. Oh my gosh. I just did the math on my phone, on the calculator. Bro, I've had to get over 200 crates to get up to 3,000. I did 200 times 15, because each crate gives you 15 gems and matter of fact i've actually opened more than 200 crates because i believe i almost went up to nearly 18 hours of extra cash um of the extra cash multiplier down here if you know what i'm talking about so yeah i was on a grind bro i was i was going i was going crazy grind was worth it though man like i can upgrade whatever the hell i want whatever comes out that i want i can upgrade it whenever i feel like it so this is awesome I also happened to pick up this F-16 skin when I was getting all the crates. By the way, all of my gems that I've gotten thus far were all from crates. Like, I grinded the crates for about... Uh, I don't even know how many hours, man. For a while. Let's just put it like that. <laughs> but grinding all these balloon crates, all the crates that drop in the middle of the city. Like, just grinding every single one of them. And, you know, you only get 15 gems out of each crate. So, I, I don't know how many I got. I must have picked up, like maybe 40 50 I, I don't know i don't know <laughs> i also have a few clips of other things that happened along the way throughout this week that i've been banned so i'm gonna play some of those for you in just a minute but i just want to say thank you to all the people that sat here waiting for my return back to youtube i really appreciate it and i missed you guys all week man like i missed uploading so freaking much and i just want to let you know that i appreciate you guys being here 100 percent I also wanted to let you guys know that we're still having the giveaway at 3,000 subscribers, so make sure you leave a like and subscribe on this video, and let's roll some clips. Yo, I just got my first 1%, bro. Dude, this is sick. This is actually the one that I wanted too, bro. Fuck that Moss tank. Bro, that tank has been in there for mad long. Yo, what's going on you guys so if you're watching this video that means that you just got done watching the first half of the video of me explaining all the gems and cash that i got out of this whole week i'm making this video before i even make that part of the video <laughs> because i'm just really eager to explain exactly what happened with youtube and it honestly could have been avoided and that's why i'm really disappointed i'm disappointed that i had to stay away for a week and I couldn't upload, I couldn't really talk to you guys unless it was on Discord, you know, I couldn't help people, so, you know, it was just kind of disappointing. But, um, I'm gonna just do my best to explain exactly what happened with me and YouTube and why I was banned for seven days. Of course, this is for the people that care. If you don't care, you know, you can obviously leave, of course, that's fine, thank you for watching this video. But for the people who do care and were asking me and want to know, I'm gonna explain it right now. A lot of people on my YouTube channel and in my Discord are Roblox YouTubers as well, and I just wanted to help them the best of my ability because a lot of people record and edit on their phones, and you know, that's hard, that's difficult. I've recorded and made YouTube videos on my phone for years prior to using Adobe Premiere Pro, which is the editor that I use now, and I understand how difficult it is to make videos and to grow on YouTube and just all those different aspects. 
So I uploaded a video on how to get my editor for free because I also, you know, I don't really pay for mine either. So I uploaded a video basically on how to get an editor for free. And uh, yeah, YouTube didn't like that very much, of course. Um, I don't know what I was thinking. I, d I just saw a lot of other YouTubers doing it. So I thought, you know, it was okay. Why not? But I pretty much uploaded a video showing how to get this editor for free. And I was giving a whole bunch of different tips on creating YouTube videos and being yourself and a bunch of other motivational things. And I was really excited to post this video, to be honest. I was, I was extremely excited. But um, it was just the fact that I was showing how to get something for free that costs money and they didn't like that. And I, I do understand that. I just don't exactly agree with the strike because it's simply, it's just a simple video that could have been deleted like immediately. Like I think I got a strike in about 20 minutes after I uploaded that video. If they had asked me to just delete it, I simply would have deleted it with no hesitation whatsoever. Uploading a video isn't worth losing my subscribers and all my fan base for an entire week. Like a week doesn't sound like a long time, it doesn't sound like a big deal, but it is to me when you motivate yourself and you become consistent with something like you don't want to stop doing it. So this week, I'm not gonna lie, has been pretty hard for me. Uh, <laughs> it it kind of sucks. But I just wanted to let you guys know exactly what happened and I'm most likely going to work on a workaround for this video and show you guys how to get an editor that's close to Adobe Premiere Pro and one that's actually free. Because I do still want to help you guys out. I just have to watch what I post because YouTube is on my behind now. And yeah, I mean, I'm not going to go on absolute depth of what happened, but that's pretty much the basis of what happened. And I just know I'm going to be so happy to be back, honestly, because it's all I think about, man. Like when I go to sleep, it's what I think about when I wake up, it's what I think about, because that's what my mind has been on for the past couple months. Like it's just been on, I wake up, make videos for you guys, check the discord, make sure you guys are all okay and stuff. Check out what, uh, check out what military tycoon has posted. Like that's the type of guy that I am. Like I literally get up and make content rather than go and eat. And it's not to boast, it's the, you know, that's not something good. It's just how I am, it's who I am. Like I would rather just go and upload and create content for you guys than go eat first. We're, we're going too in depth here, we're going too in depth here. But I just wanna say thank you all to everyone who is still here. I really appreciate you all. Um, it, it, it really does mean the world to me. And I know that we are going to break YouTube one day, 100%. So thank you all to the people that stayed here and waited out the whole week just to see my videos. I really freaking appreciate that, man. Like me saying that I appreciate it is a huge understatement, but thank you again. And we have a lot of giveaways, a tournament, and a lot of crazy things coming up and a lot of awesome content coming up. So if you guys want to be a part of that, make sure you leave a like and subscribe to on post notifications. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.